I've always been an athlete. I started with swimming and then I get involved in triathlons and as time goes on, your life <laughs> takes on a lot of responsibilities. So I've really narrowed it down to biking. And where I live here in Jupiter, Florida, it's just, it's magical. I get to wake up, watch the sunrise in the morning, I'm surrounded by amazing positive people. And for me, I just get such a pump. It's just a way for me to start the day. And the more time I get to spend out there, it's just the more I fall in love with it. Then I started racing and I was got pretty good at that. And that, of course, is very motivating. You know, who doesn't like winning? I mean, I, you know, I kind of have a joke, I don't mind not winning, but I just hate losing. And my motto going out to the race was, um, if you even think about beating me, you better wake up and apologize now. So I went out there with that attitude because you have to. You know, you can be physically fit, but unless your mind is really strong, um, you're gonna lose to other competition. When it comes to the mental portion of it, you know, we always think that when we're out biking, it's physical. And I think for me personally, so much of it's mental. Honestly, at 53, you know, soon to be 54, my goal is um, I want to see how much I can push myself. It's called the National Senior Games, and they're games that are put on for people you have to be minimum age of 50 years old. So the highlight for me, it wasn't just winning the gold, it was um, finding the oldest gentleman out there doing the same race I did. And he was 94 years old, and he's on a time trial and he had an amazing time, so I got a picture taken with him and I. And that's when I realized if we take care of our, you know, if we take care of our bodies, you know, if we eat well and we exercise, that, you know what, at 94, I could still be doing this race. Eight years ago, um, I was doing triathlons and really thought I was healthy. I thought I was, sup I thought I was eating right. I thought I was supplementing. And it wasn't until I put my hand on the scanner. And when I scored a whooping 17,000, that was my wake-up call. Pharmanix products, you know, I will tell you that they're a big part of um, what I'm doing. They keep my body just really fine-tuned and um, that's, I would never stop taking them and my goal is to share them with as many people as I can. People are, are baby boomers, are about quality of life and that's where Pharmanix products come in because they, they're going to allow us to continue doing what we want to do and have an active lifestyle. Any negativity, anything that's going on, I leave it out there. So I normally come back, feel about 10, 20 pounds lighter because I leave the bad stuff out. I bring back nothing but the good stuff and I'm ready just to have a magical day. Hi, my name is Kathy Petrillo and this is how I live Farminets.